first stop, Curry. Run. Look at this. Got some beef curry this time. Hey, Incredible. Never gets old. Oh my god. Look at that S13. It is OEM and beautiful. Good to go. We have a long rest of the day. So it's kind of Aaron stuff and we get to have fun tonight. We're gonna be making our way down to Tokyo because we're gonna be staying in Tokyo tonight. This is also a special trip because this is gonna be the last time I ever drive the Tokyo Drift Evo in Japan. Really? This is your big finale? This is the big finale, dude. Really? I just, I, I just was thinking about that. So last time I'll be driving the Evo here in Japan because it has to actually come back to America. Well, I have a fingerprint on yeah, here. Your next Japan car, does it? Can't aren't tell aren't you, you gonna come back to Japan anymore? You're not gonna, gonna make the best out of it, making our way to Tokyo for one night on this trip before we make our way to Scuba. And uh, before we do that, gonna go to Mama and Papa Masa's house so Masa can get my attack pass. And then we're gonna be heading to the area to go pick up some tools. So we need tools for attack. And then tonight is Daikoku night, our one and only Daikoku night this trip. We are gonna make the best out of it and it's gonna be a ton of fun. So. We have a far drive to Tokyo. Let's get going. Ikimashou. Masanouchi. Yep, they're gone. Tadaima! And nobody here. No parents? Yep. Oh man. It's so empty without Mama Masa and Papa Masa. Watashi no Nihon no Oji san to Oka san. <laughs> but they're not here. There you go. Coolest part of all. So, this is why we came to Masa's house, actually. Yeah. Oh, my past. This is so surreal, dude. This is insane. It's happening. I'm gonna cherish this for forever. Now yep. I just have to, now I just have to do it. So our driver pass for attack scuba. Here we go, guys. Now it is completely official. Mission number one down. Next up, tools from a factory gearbox, which I'm super excited about. We'll talk about that once we make it there. I know we have been absolutely all over the place today, but. We are extremely busy before attack this weekend and we're trying to fit as much in as we possibly can with the short amount of time that we have. Next up, like I said, we are heading to Factory Gearbox, which is actually an amazing new sponsor that's taking care of us for attack so that we have tools at attack and actually letting us bring some really amazing tools back to the US, which I'm super pumped for. Tonight's gonna be awesome. It's gonna be Tim's first time at Daikoku and our last time in the Evo there as well. So we're gonna try and get some night runs in, see some friends and have some fun. But first up, let's go check out some badass tools. Cool heaven in here, Tim. Yes. We're getting some good stuff today. Let's check it out. Oh, God. <laughs> key day. Yeah, key day. <laughs> Those are all. Whoa. It's so, so nice. It's, everything is for J Japanese cars. Oh, look cars. how cool this is, too. Wow. Yeah, it's all specified for Japanese cars. Yeah, right? all yeah. specified for Japanese cars. So it's all in millimeters. Oh, tire yeah, gauge. Tire gauge. It's in PSI, too. So good. I, got the yeah, I, uh, uh, I know Tim Bro is geeking out right now. I'm, I'm about to spend lots of money. Let's, see, let's check it out. So we got our basic tool set, which is yes. cool. But Tim wants some extra tools in here. So it's like, I can't believe it's just like random there's, stores like yes. this. <laughs> there's no stores in the US like this. Yeah. Like there, there's no store that has an individual pieces that you would possibly need. I know. And this is like 
It's literally like, built for yes. people like us. Yes. Race cars. <laughs> like Building have, race cars. You have an oil little gun <laughs> here. You've got oil things. This uh, is just like for building engines. This is just a cool side of Japan that yeah. we get to see, you know? It's like, like every, the, every specialized tool that you could want. And they have different brands made in Japan. I mean, it's all just super, super nice. So mission number two for today, big check mark. This is awesome. We got some good stuff. This is gonna help us when we get back home for sure. Yeah, the, I'm excited for every bit of it. So. <laughs> what a cool little shop too. If you guys are ever in Tokyo and need some tools, factory gear. Oh. It's a heavier. <laughs> <laughs> Look who it is! Yushi! What's up, man? Good to see you, Yushi. Good to see you, man. Have a fun night, dude. See you, uh, guys. Fun, a fun week. Walking up to this car in Japan will literally never get old. The fact that this car is here blows my mind. <laughs> Like always, it's been a very long day, but it feels like our night is just getting started. Now that we have the whole squad here, we're gonna be heading to a special spot that Masa picked out. He said it's some of his favorite Japanese food, so I'm super excited to try this out. These are definitely my favorite kinds of night sushi. Walking down the alleyways, getting some bomb food. I know, right? I love it. <laughs> Look at this. So cool. This is actually my friend's place. Nice. Those are all right. So I didn't know this, but tonight we're getting something called okonomiyaki, which is one of my favorite things to eat here in Japan. We've only had it once before in Osaka where the food actually originated, but okonomiyaki the best way I can describe for for an American is like a Japanese pancake thing. It is amazing, but with tons of like vegetables and I mean, really, you could put a bunch of different things in it, right? You'll, you'll see. It's so good. I want an explanation of monja. What is monja? That's what I mean. You have to have a look. Then you tell me your explanation. Okay. Please. Are we gonna have monja? Yeah. This um this restaurant is called Kodama. Is really known for having a good monja yaki. Okay. Monja yaki. Monja yaki. Okay. So we're gonna have okonomiyaki and monja yaki. Oh, I'm so excited. Come uh, so on. Okay. So this is like the uh, the watered down version of okonomiyaki. Yes, exactly. So, so, th so this is more of like a sauce base. Yeah, it's it's more of a sauce base one. Yeah, you guys will see what okonomiyaki is after this one. This looks delicious. I've never had manjiyaki before. So we scoop it like this. It just yeah make it make these like a uh, burnt spots like intentionally yeah so that like the the sauce inside actually kind of accumulates it and makes it into like a makes it hard makes it hard yeah like this is basically we put it on a plate mm. really good it's a saucy a saucy okonomiyaki choishi I've got it, Yushi. Sauce pancake. That sounds brilliant. <laughs> oh, 
Like I said, the Japanese pancake. It's so good. It's actually originated from the Kansai region. I guess people that lived in the outskirts. They kind of mixed a bunch of different foods and sauces together because it was something cheap and easy to make and came up with this. And it is absolutely delicious. One of my favorite meals to have in Japan. And that is a proper okonomiyaki. Here we go. Come on. There we go. Oh, oh, one of the best meals ever. Oh, so much. <laughs> Amazing dinner. <laughs> Amazing dinner. <laughs> Good choice, food. Masa. Good choice. Honestly, could not have asked for a better day today, but it's not over yet. Before the night ends, we're gonna do some Tokyo runs, have some fun, and actually make our first stop tonight at Daikoku. And then, oh god. Ugh. Ugh. And then, see where the night takes us. First Daikoku night of the trip. So good, and maybe the last one ever with the Evo, which is actually crazy. And tonight is great. It's a Thursday night, so usually it's pretty good and it doesn't get shut down as early as it would on a weekend. So we're gonna see some pretty amazing cars here tonight. Tim, first Daikoku experience, what do you think? I'm um, overwhelmed. Oh. How does it feel in person versus watching the videos? What's it like? So I'm so curious. Honestly, it's completely different in person. Like it's super sick. Like, yeah. <laughs> like you're surrounded by all these cars and like every once in a while just another car pops in. Here comes the RX-8 action. It's, it's just it's just mind-blowing. It is. <laughs> it's, it's really sick. So today's actually the 15th little S15 day here at Daikoku. Super cool. Lots of really clean cars. <laughs> Dude, this red one is so dope. Definitely uh, on the list of cars I'd like to own. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They're such a nice car, yeah. right? Yeah. They look really, really sexy. Oh, this one's on OGTEs with the white. This is definitely like my spec. So nice. Inspiration. This thing is so tight. Oh my god. Another skyline that I've never seen. So this is a Skyline Yon Mary. So same generation as the Ken Mary, but with four doors. And a little 90s hip hop in there. Wow. So badass, man. The coolest things you see at Daikoku. Yeah, it's pretty sick. This is sick, man. Yeah. 2000 GTX is the badge that's on it. Wow. I think it's gnarly, dude. All right, our Daikoku tradition. Ashiria coffee. Okay, you guys ready? Oh, Oh, I got it. Oh, Oh, hey, <laughs> Shit, I, this I will do. <laughs> I will do. <laughs> this one. <laughs> one coffee or you don't want coffee? Yeah. Match me in heaven here. <laughs> How cute you guys are. <laughs> <laughs> Always love seeing a good GTR at Daikoku. So nice. Simple and clean builds. The Evo here in Japan runs out of gas, as you guys know. We've driven close to 100 miles today, which means uh, we're pretty much empty. So before, before we can do anything, I gotta fill this guy up. 
more and more cars are trickling in. Super sick 86 over here that I want to check out real fast. Beautiful chaser on some TEs. So good. I will forever and always have a soft spot in me for an 86, especially 11 coupe. I love this so much, man. And a Tiffany blue skyline. Some really awesome cars here tonight. We're gonna do something that we haven't done in a very long time, WonCon runs. We've got the boys here, we've got Indra and Yushi's awesome fit back here. We haven't gone for a nice cruise on the WonCon in such a long time. Yeah, let's just nice cruise, right? Tonight's the night, yeah. Tonight's the <laughs> night to do a nice run. cruise. No way better to end a day than some midnight Tokyo runs. So we've got the Evo, Indra's awesome R35, and the Yushi fit. The Yushi, the Yushi, Yushi fit. The Yushi special fit. I know. Super sick. This is gonna be a ton of fun. The interior looks so sick now, with all of the gauges and the Gretti boost controller here. Oh, the startup sequence is so rad. Sick Evo Seven. Oh. God, the rain's coming, man. Yes, we sick. got some good stuff. It was sick. Can't it was wait. sick. <laughs> I got a bit of go home, man. Jamata. Ja, oh, yes, 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 yes. <laughs> Crap. We got some really bad weather coming right now, so I think yeah. we made it perfect timing. Yeah, we want this. Avoid the rain as much as possible. Oh, oh. <laughs> I think it's time for us to go home. Let's go. Let's go. Japan is so cool, man. I think that was an epic send off for the last trip in the Evo, but definitely don't want to get stuck in a storm in the Evo, especially before attack. So. Also, it's 12 o'clock in the morning. We should probably head home. So he's leaving and we'll see you guys at the Airbnb. Sick. Check this place out. Whoa. Sick, dude. Welcome to our home for the night. Oh yeah, definitely uh, definitely bedtime. Guys, I'm about to absolutely crash. It is almost three o'clock in the morning. Oh, this Airbnb is so sick, but unfortunately we have no home base for this trip since we're gonna be traveling around so much, getting ready for attack. But this was a perfect Airbnb to come crash at. Edit until 3 a.m., the Wi-Fi was insanely fast and now i'm just rambling on because i'm so delirious tonight was amazing it's always nights like these when i'm up till three in the morning that i will for sure remember cruising the streets of tokyo with friends is 
unlike anything else. So tomorrow we have an extremely long day, and if you guys stayed this long in the video, I'm gonna give you a little sneak peek. Tomorrow we are dino tuning the Evo. It's gonna be the first start of the Midori Savi build R34 GTR. I can't believe I'm saying that. Anyways guys, I'm gonna get some sleep. Thank you so much for watching. The Need Money for GTR collection is live right now on the site, and every $1 that you spend, is one entry in to win the giveaway FK. And if you're a VIP member, you guys get up to 10 times entries. First link down in the description box below. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you haven't already, make sure you guys hit that like button. Leave me a comment down below. And of course, don't forget to subscribe. We'll see you guys in tomorrow's video. Oyasuminasai. Oh,